the Breath of the Wild 2 news. Zelda の伝説 Breath of the Wild 続編の発売時期に関してお知らせがあります。Oh, Anuma's hair looks nice like that. 本作は2022年に発売を予定しているとお伝えしていましたが、開発にもう少しお時間をいただきたく、発売を2023年春に変更させていただきたいと思います。Hey everybody, Amanda Van Heil here with the Zelda Universe. It is time for a breaking Zelda news. Well, there it is. Breath of the Wild 2 is officially delayed to spring of 2023. You know, is it better to delay a game rather than rush it and end up with a bad game and like endless crunch for all the employees? Of course, it's better to delay it. Doesn't make it any less disappointing. And also, I mean, though, at the same time, like, it was expected to come out around holiday season of this year. So, spring of 2023 is really only a delay of, like, what, three or four months, something like that, just depending on when. I mean, Breath of the Wild, the first one came out in March of 2017, and it was a spring release as well. So, hopefully, it's sooner rather than later. That being said, The announcement did give us a little more footage of the game and some things we can look forward to, so let's go over some of these images real quick. Alright, so let's take a look at this first one here. So we've got a nice shot of Link's messed up arm and also beautiful pectoral muscles. Alright, that's my one thirsty comment. That's, that, that's it. That's, the, that's all I'm getting. So, I'm getting some kind of like Miroku from Inuyasha vibes here with the gloved hand and obviously some kind of power emanating from it. I assume it's Triforce power. And then also, the Master Sword is pretty busted, and I don't think that's something you can just pass off to an Octorok and get that to buff out for you. But okay, what we really want to look at is these etchings that are in the ground behind him. I don't know what any of it means, but it's there for a reason. All right, now here it says that there will be an even wider variety of features you can enjoy. So, first off, I'm pretty sure this is the selfie cam mode, and I am just basing that off of the way he's just looking at the camera. And the angle and new expressions for selfie mode would qualify as a wider variety of features. And finally, new encounters and new gameplay elements. All right, check out that Triforce fringe on Link's shirt. I'm just loving the little details here, and I really like his hair there. I don't know, I just I love that spiky in the back. It looks really cool. I'm really looking forward to who all we get to meet and revisit this go round. So, who all do you hope to see? I'll tell you what new encounter I want. I want Link to encounter Zelda's lips. <laughs> so, yeah,、uh, it was a surprise announcement today from Nintendo. They just Dropped it with Aonuma telling us that Breath of the Wild 2, whatever it's g o i n g to be called, it will be here in spring. Hopefully, that'll be the last delay for it. I don't know when we'll hear anything else、um, based on when the first Breath of the Wild came out. We got the title that E3, and then we got the game that March. So that would have been June to March. So. I mean, maybe that's what we're gonna get at E3 this year? Or what would be E3, digital E3? I don't know what you wanna call it anymore. But of course, as always, stay tuned to Zelda Universe for the latest in Zelda updates. And you know, as much as I was really looking forward to this, and this was like the one thing I was looking forward to all year, what else do we have to look forward to this year? There's Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, which is gonna be coming out. Around the same time Breath of the Wild would have been coming out. There's the new Zeno Blade.、Uh, we've got Splatoon this summer. So it's, it's not a total loss. And, you know, next year it'll just have to be game of the year. And we, we've got something to get us through the cold season in the winter to look forward to spring again. So, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm Amanda Van Heil, and I will see you guys soon.